Hey neighbors, how y'all doing? It's Miss C, and I'm back with another Dollar General haul. <laughs> it's about that time, it's a whole nother month, and I had to get prepared and ready. Do you hear me? So let's go through what I bought. And how much money I saved and on which items did I save on. So, this is the good old yellow Dollar General bag. I think they might be the same worldwide, but ours is yellow. So, let's start. Okay, push some of this to the side. Go from the this side to this side over here. Okay, starting with this Lysol cleaner. I know a lot of people like scrubbing bubbles, but I use this um, Lysol Power Foam bathroom cleaner to clean my tub. In my sink and it does a wonderful job and it's only 250 <coughs> for this big tall bottle which is um, 24 ounces and the scrubbing bubbles is smaller than this and it costs more so you already know me <laughs> I'm going to get the most for my money, honey. And this is good old Ajax. The Ultra Ajax Bleach Activated in Grapefruit. I told y'all my obsession with grapefruit. I can't eat it. Ooh, that's tight. I can't even get that up. But I love to smell it. And it smells so good with some hot water. You put that hot water in that sink and you take this right here, that Ajax, and pull your little bit up in there. Woo! Smelling good. All right. Next is a bottle of Smart Water. Now, the reason why I bought this is because I wanted to try it out. I've never tasted it before, and yes, I know Smart Water been on the market forever, but um, I've never tried it, so whoop, there it is. <laughs> so hopefully it tastes good. If anybody likes Smart Water, let me know. I like that it said is. Uh, vapor distilled water um, and they add calcium and potassium and electro electrolytes for taste purity you can taste hydration you can feel mm. they selling that water ain't they honey so smart water mm -hmm. Okay, the next thing I bought was some stocking caps or wave caps and they were a dollar. This one was a dollar. This one was a dollar fifty. I wanted to try them out. I think this one might be a little bit thicker. But y'all yeah, know your girl wear wigs. So therefore, when I put a wig on, I can help lay my natural hair down so the wig can fit more tighter and closer on my head. So, I will be trying those out really soon when I start doing my wig reviews. I haven't done them yet, y'all. I know. But I'm getting to it. There's a lot going on right now with regular life. So, I just don't feel like playing dress up right now. <laughs> but when I do, best believe I'm going to be on it. Okay. The next thing, do it have a next thing up in here? No, these are just 
bags that I got. When I go, I ask if I can have some bags because I use these for my little trash cans around my house. And yes, that's ghetto, but I don't care, okay? Because I don't got time to be trying to impress nobody. Trash is going in the bag, and I'm throwing the bag away. So, what's the use of buying expensive little baby trash bags? It ain't no need. It ain't no need. So, I got me a bag of bags to use. And the ones that also, that my stuff is in, I also use those as well. Hey, look. I live smarter, not harder. And I don't spend unnecessary money. So, if they say I can have some bags, guess what Miss C gonna do? <laughs> I'm gonna take the bags. <laughs> you think I'm not? All right, and I know you do it too. Ain't nobody in your house right now, but you. But if somebody come and visit and you don't have time to spruce up the house before they come, I bet y'all see some trash bags. Don't try to fool me. I know you be trying to put the good stuff out when company is coming over. That's why you be mad when people just pop up. <laughs> when people just pop up at your house because you didn't time to. You didn't have time to put all your little good stuff out so you can show out. I know. You ain't fooling me. Not Missy. <laughs> you ain't fooling me, honey. I know what the deal is. Now, my first little one I had caught on sale was the Dixie Ultra. This is, um... I guess the ultra part is new, but they didn't make them stronger. So I didn't got some bowls. And I have gotten the plates. Now these are not the largest plates. And that's because you know your girl is on her weight loss journey. And I have found that if I use a smaller plate and smaller bowls, that I will eat less. But if I have a big huge plate. And. I have. My food. In that plate. I must be like. I need some more food. To fill up the plate. It will be about filling up the plate. And not exactly what I'm eating. So when you. Eat from a smaller surface. It tricks your mind to thinking. You're eating a lot of food. And you're really not. And you know it's purple. And you know I love me some purple. And the only bad thing about it is the bowls didn't have the same pattern. But either way, it don't matter. So in my up and coming mukbangs, yes, you will be seeing disposable plates and bowls. Look, <laughs> all I'm doing is eating off of it. And throwing it away. I know a lot of people have nice pretty dishes. When I become a bigger YouTuber. And they start paying me once I finally get monetized. Which is taking a while. But hopefully they are on, it's on its way. They say they have been backed up. Trying to approve everybody. So patience is the key. But your girl have been waiting a little while. <laughs> but... I picked these up because um, they say if you purchase two of them, you will get $2 off. So, that's why I went ahead and stocked up with the Dixie. And that's a great brand. <coughs> Their plates are really strong. They, um, they're cut resistant, uh, mic microwavable. And soak proof shield. It says ultra strength for whatever you dish out. Mm, I hear that, Dixie. I really do like their brand. So I continue to purchase their brand all the time. And when I check my mail, it has coupons in it. And I saw the coupons for the Dixie. And I knew it was time to re up, honey. It was time for me to get some more. So that's what I did. Okay. So next is 
the Dollar General brand disinfectant wipes. Um, I could have bought the lock, the Lysol ones, and the Clorox ones, but these smell just as good, and I'm getting more for my money. And as of right now, that's what your girl is doing, saving them coins. And if I can get something that's going to do the same and still disinfect, then hey, it is what it is. And with this one, I get two scents. I get the lemon and the fresh scent. And it's 40, um, 75 wipes in each of these containers. So yeah, I will be trying those out. Usually, yes, I get the Clorox one and the... Um, the Clorox ones are the ones I usually get, but they were kind of expensive. So I was like, look, I don't got time for this. Just give me the big one. <laughs> so I got that one. Y'all, in my last Dollar General haul, I purchased this. And it smelled so good. And it has your body smelling really good it's the dial silk and um magnolia moisturizing body wash i have like this much left in my shower as of right now and i was like i have to get some more it's worth the two dollars and change it smells so good and y'all i washed under my arms with this right here honey real good <laughs> i was watching real good real good real good babe i got out that tub almost all day every time i raised up my arms or i was doing something i could smell this this stay with you and it smells so good so i was like i gotta i gotta get it again i bought me some baby wash yeah baby wash hair and body i use this um because it's good for sensitive skin and i can use this to clean my face if i don't want anything harsh you can use it on your tappy down there um if you need something gentle and regular soap is too harsh for you use baby soap it's a gentle more gentle formula so it does not cause irritation i am trying the new secret tropical orchid it was a dollar it was a dollar at dollar general and it smells so good mm. every time like they get a new scent i try to try because some scents smell good on me and some don't so you gotta find what works for you so hopefully this do because it smells great it smells really good and it was a dollar so you can't beat it whoop there it is because i don't know your body as you get older your body changes your chemical balance change and one minute my body likes to spray on deodorant you know like the dove and um secret has a spray on and degree has a spray on deodorant sometimes my body like those and sometimes my body likes the solids so it just depends on what keeps you freshest the longer what don't break you out what um does its job okay that's that's what the order is for to make sure you ain't around here stanky and funky okay because you're a lady or you're a gentleman and you don't need to be funky you need to smell nice and fresh and good at all times especially when you are around people that's very important but you want to be fresh and clean around yourself too. Look, be clean all the time. <laughs> okay, just be clean all the time. But especially when you go in public, you do not want to offend anybody with your B.O., okay? That's just, you just would be out of line for that. That's a no-no. And I got some more um, 
dial hand soap for my bathroom. I tried this one out the last time too. This was a dollar and it smells really good and it keeps your hands pretty soft. It has like an oil formula. So yeah, I, I enjoyed it. So I picked that up again. Moving right along. Let's see. Oh man. I forgot it. See, I don't be playing. When I be doing these um calls, I don't be playing at all. I not already started using my Tide. I bought some Tide Tide, their new Simply formula because it was on sale. And it's in my washroom. I went and got that detergent. So, here we go. So, this is the next thing I purchased and I'm trying it out new. I had a coupon for it. This is the Tide Simply simply Clean Fresh Pods and Refreshing Breeze. These work really good and they smell good. Now, the scent is Refreshing Breeze, but it don't smell like a man, but it's not a super, super girly scent it's not like gain and all of gains different for breeze formulas and all that it smells really good but it's not like a real fruity smell this is a smell like if you like the clean scent or the um like the cotton fresh like glade air freshener and stuff it's more like a nice clean unisex smell it's not really fruity and it's not really sweet sweet it's just a nice clean fresh scent and this is a pack of 43 and it was eight dollars and i think 75 cents but i had a dollar off coupon so it brought it down to seven dollars and 75 cents for 43 and that's not bad because gaming pods cost more than that and they only give you like 31 and 26 and I'm like oh, I'm getting this one so I got a dollar off of this the two dollars off of the Dixie products so that's three dollars right there and I got two dollars off of the game Woohoo! now it just wasn't for the powder the gang coupon could have been used on the pods but I can clean 40 loads with this it says 80 but I put two scoops in all of my loads so that's just me um, because I used to use powder a long time ago but when the pods came out you know you jump on the bed and wag and want what's new or whatever and the pods are good but hey the bang for my buck is where it's about and I love the smell of game so therefore I went ahead and just picked up the box and um this was ten dollars um and I think fifty cents so I got two dollars off of here so it made it eight dollars and fifty cents okay I got my rubbing alcohol in one of my videos someone commented about my skin and they say Missy how do you keep your skin looking so fresh and beautiful and all that stuff and I told them I use rubbing alcohol <laughs> like after I clean my face with something gentle I have one of those little Neutrogena scrub brushes after I do that I let it air dry or whatever and I disinfect my face. I keep my face free from germs. 
I keep my hands out of my face so I do not pick in my face all the time because through the day somebody might be working your nerves and you touch your face or what is up with this thing with people like to put their hands in your face oh my goodness I don't know but if people like so put their hands in your face. Tell them. Don't you do that no more. You might like my face. You might think I'm beautiful, cute, whatever. But keep your hands about my face. Because people don't wash their hands these days. And honey, this is how I keep my face looking good. I disinfect my face. And yes, it stings. It burns almost like witch hazel, but I didn't got used to the stinging burn, so now it feels good to me. It might not feel good to you, but this is what works for me. When I was little, I used to see my dad on the edge of the bed, not the edge of the bed, but the side of the bed, and he would be rubbing alcohol on his face, and I'd be like, is you crazy? That's going to hurt. That's going to burn because I would think about it when I would have a cut or a bobo or something. Or I hurt myself as a little kid. He would go and get this alcohol and clean the bobo or whatever and it would burn. So when I saw him putting this on his face, I thought he was nuts. Okay. I thought he was crazy. But he never had problems with his skin. And I don't have problems with mine. So, hey. It is what it is. I didn't I needed me some batteries. These are the Dollar General brand. They probably will not last as long as Duracell or Energizer. But they are due for now. They was a dollar or two dollars or something for 20 batteries. And all I'm gonna do is put it in my remote because that's the only thing that use up all the batteries in other stuff so I got some batteries that I needed okay Is this the last thing oh no y'all know I needed to get me some good old toilet paper <laughs> some good old TP baby toilet paper and I know this is not my lavender scent paper but it is still the same brand but y'all uh Georgia Pacific is tripping because the scented one the one I like the lavender one is five dollars right and this one is five dollars too but they give you a whole lot more toilet paper in this one. So I guess they figured since the one I like smell good that they could give you less paper, less toilet paper because of the smell. And I was like, that's not cool, but I still have a pack of the scented one. So I was like, just let me get a non-scented one and just get a whole lot more toilet paper. And what I'll do is alternate like one week i'll have the smell good paper in there the next week i'll have a regular one and that's just how i'm gonna do it because that's not cool you just gonna charge me extra i mean you're not gonna give me as much paper just because i like it scented but Companies are companies and they gonna make their money the way they make their money. But either way, I bought the non-scented one because they give you a whole lot more paper for your money. And that's the kick I'm on right now, saving them coins. Ooh, -wee, this bag heavy. Okay, what's, what's next? Alright, I think this is my last bag. Yeah, I probably like, dang, Missy, you really went shopping there. I did because I really only shop once a month. So I try to get everything I need so I don't have to keep going back 
so I can use all my poop on and stuff. Okay. I'm gonna toilet paper over here on the flizzo. Okay. Take a little sip. Mm -mm -mm. All right. I got baby wipes. 216 wipes. And I keep them in the bathroom to stay nice and clean and fresh. Ladies, wipe yourself off real good after you go to the bathroom. Men, if you're doing the number two, you already know you need to clean yourself. If you're not able to take a bath right after you do your business. Because that's the only way you truly going to really just super feel clean and fresh. After a good restroom visit, let me put it like that, you should take a bath if you have the time to. But if you don't, your next best option is baby wipes. Keep yourself nice and clean and fresh. Okay, yes. Next is my good old everyday panty liners. These are the Dollar General brand. It is $5 for 108. I use these because it gives you um, a lot for your money. And they work very well. They are absorbent. And I like them. And they cheap. Yeah. <laughs> They do their job, and that's all that matters to me. And other penny liners are like, I don't want to necessarily say they're expensive, but like these, I like these because they're wide. And I like the carefree, you know, the ones that come in the little packages, all cute and stuff. I like them, but your girl... It's fluffy, okay. So I need me something with a little bit more room, some with some real coverage. And these are long and wider, so they protect my meow. Meow, you know, a little bit better. But them other ones is like long and thin. What am I supposed to do with that? I have to use more of them to get good coverage. I have to take unwrap two of them and put them side by side and lay them in my panties. What? I don't got time to be wasting stuff, so that's why I just get these because they fit your girl. That's right. And I got some gain fabric softeners that have they keep the clothes smelling good when you put them in the dryer. And that is a 34 count because I don't use them all the all the time because I use detergent that smells really good this is this is the trick right here if you have detergent like gain like the gain I have or the tide that's very strong scented and smell really good you really don't need the fabric softener unless you have a lot of clothes that's very staticky and that have like a lot of cotton in it that makes your clothes stick together like microfiber and cotton oh my gosh you would definitely need to put some of them in there but if you have a cheaper brand detergent and the smell is not really good then most definitely get you some fabric softener um, because they're stronger scented and they also do their job, but they'll make your clothes smell really good. That's my trick. So, if I couldn't afford Tider Gain and had to get the little cheap powder or, or something else, uh, like Purex or anything else, then a good fabric softener will work good for you and your clothes will still come out nice and clean and fresh the last thing is my kleenexes buy three get one free my last deal i got last time this was only four dollars and fifty cents
Yes, you heard me right. For four boxes of Kleenex, it was $4.50. And that's a pretty good deal because this Kleenex is really soft. And I enjoy them. And some other brands of Kleenex, you can get like a smaller box for like a dollar or something. But I'm so used to using this brand. I just, I just like it. And it's really soft. It don't irritate my nose. It don't turn it red. So, yeah. So, this was my last item. And the money I saved, I used my Dollar General coupons where you get $5 off of $25. So, I used two of them. So, that was $10 I saved. With my purchases, I saved a dollar off of this and I saved two dollars off of the game and two dollars off of the Dixie. So that's 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 dollars I saved. So, <laughs> your girl's on a roll. Thank you so much for joining me for my Dollar General haul video. I appreciate it. Give your girl a thumbs up. If you use any of the products I use on Jarm or if you know something better that I could try out and use that you love, leave a comment down below. Um, and next time when I do my shopping, I might just take you up on that suggestion. And let's see. Subscribe if you haven't. What you waiting for? It's free. Do that thing. <laughs> and you will truly be blessed by it. And I will see all of you next time. Bye. So if they say I can have some bags, guess what Miss C gonna do? <laughs> I'm gonna take the bag. Thank you so much for joining me for my Dollar General haul video. I appreciate it. Give your girl a thumbs up.